Hey guys, welcome to another episode in Project DIY. Um, does your car Honda Accord Cross Tour from 2010, I believe, all the way up to 14, if I'm not mistaken? They should have the same brake light. And people have reportedly written on the internet that the car will do this. Instead of this. So the problem with that is the brake pedal, there's like a little sensor that you might want to switch out. But the thing is, if the sensor was broke, then how come the bar here works and not the side ones? So what you might want to try is just start with re replacing the bolts here the, on the brake lights. So that's usually the common issue on this. What I got for the brake lights is again off Amazon. I got the LED brake lights. I'm gonna show you in the description where to find these and um, for the price they were really good and this is supposed to be a little bit brighter than the regular ones so um, let's get to it so after we remove the screws then all you do is grab here and pivot it this way out okay right here is a little tab so don't be afraid to pull it and thinking that you might be breaking stuff here in the back but there's an actual um, like it's tab that needs to be popped out so just keep pulling it or wiggling it out like this after it pops out So the brake light bulb is going to be this one here. This one here is the reverse signal when you back up. And this one here are the left and right, which in this case the right hand signal. So we'll be dealing with this one here. All you do is twist. And when you're removing bulbs on a car, it's good to have either gloves or I use like a little paper towel just so the oil in your fingers won't get on the bulb because it can create hot spots and make the bulb go out prematurely. Just pull on this. Like so, and we'll install this one. You just pop it in here. With LED lights, I don't really care about, you know, the oil in the fingers because it's different from a bulb. Okay. should click back in place like so all right now you'll line up the little tabs here so they mm -hmm. go in their right holes here in the back and you just pop them in you're good to go now we'll put the screws and we'll repeat the same process on the other side all right guys thank you for watching